Okay, so for this question, it says the expression 7 m plus 3 describes how much Alicia paid during a shopping trip. M is the amount she paid for each of the seven t-shirts. Three is how much she paid for a pair of socks. For a part, how much did she pay when she bought the t-shirts at the regular time? Ms. Carisha Hayden, if you're in the building, call extension 190. <clears throat> how much will she pay if she gets the t-shirts on sale for $10 each? Well, <clears throat> I think that we would have to put M in for like the 12 and the for A part and 10 for B part. And uh, I think a good math practice would be number one, working it out step by step and following the order of operations, pivots. Okay, so, so I'll give you question seven and question seven and question how much did she pay? Well, she bought the t-shirt. When she bought the t-shirt, she bought the t-shirt. So wouldn't the regular price be 12? So it would be 7 times 12 plus 3. I think that would be the multiplication of 12. Sorry, so 7 times 12. And then we do addition. So 84 plus 3 would be 87. So remember, um, yeah. Uh, on letter A is how much did she pay when she bought the oh, yeah. So um, okay. she paid twenty-seven dollars, and then she oh, so bought. Wait, she bought she 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 the shirts. Bought the t-shirts at there. So for B part, okay, so it so seven times ten plus three. Ten times multiplication. So one be seven yeah, so you do seven times ten. Yeah, that's the socks, that's the t shirt. It's so asking how much did she pay all together. Yeah. 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 I'm pretty sure it's how much did she pay. So she bought the t shirts. At the regular price, how much did she pay all together? I think that's what Well, no, because it's saying how much will she save. How much did she pay? 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 So, uh, for B, it would be 7 times 10 plus 3. So, pin that, we do more. There is no parentheses in it, so we do. So, we do 7 times 10 is 7 times 10. Yeah. Um, Okay, so for before we can find out B, we have to find out how much she changed. So we have to subtract 87 from 73. And I got 14. Okay, so B is, so for each of the t-shirts, for each of the t-shirts, I guess I think we are. Okay. So what we did was we followed PEMDAS and it says the expression 7M plus 3. <coughs>
And so we knew that 12 was M. So because it says how much did she pay when she bought the t-shirts at the regular price, which was $10. So we did 7 times 12. <clears throat> and we got 74. Then we added 3 because... <clears throat> it it said for every shirt she she bought a pair of socks which was three dollars and we got eighty seven for part A and for part B it says how much will she save if she gets the t-shirts on sale for ten dollars each we <clears throat> we did seven and M which would the M would be we'd replace the M with ten and we got seventy plus three which is 73. Then it says how much will she save, so we took 87 and minus it from, <coughs> subtracted it from 73, and so what we got was she would save $14 if she bought them on sale. <sighs> Did everyone hear our solution and understand each step? Mm -hmm. <coughs> We don't know the same thing that you did. We saw that we didn't have any parentheses or exponents or division, so we went to multiplication. And we saw that we had an M to be side of the 7, and we had to replace that M with 12, and so we multiplied 7 times 12, which equals 84, and then we had to add 3 to that, so we got $87. And so for our A part, we said she paid $87 when she bought the T-shirts. Okay, um, and then for B part, we said that um, we had to replace M with 10 because it wants to know that if she got on sale for $10, how much would she save? And so we done 7 times 10 equals 70. We had to add 3, which equals $73. So we subtracted $87 from, we subtracted $73 from $87 and got $14. So we said she would save $14 if she gets the t-shirts on sale for $10 each. Okay, so um, our, um, the team the agreed upon solution is, for A part, would be, um, she paid $87. Okay, for B part, it would be, she will save $14. Okay, so our math practice will be number one, um, working step by step uh, and following the order of operations, PEMDAS. Okay.